I'm with Yelena Raporyeva, and we are at the Village Green in Windsor, New York, and we're going to be looking at a very historic property. Yelena, thanks for being on the show today. Thank you for having me again here. Now, where are we? What are we going to do here? We are at 98 Main Street, and it is a historical part of Windsor, and um, Com we completely rebuilt, renovated, restored. By the way, it took them five years completely to renovate this place. And it's an award-winning property by the Preservation Association of the Southern Tier. Right. And we, it's very nice location because we're right next to Route 17 and Route 79. Yes. A great location. Let's go take a look. Let's go. What a beautiful place. Yes, it's meticulously renovated, 1872 building. Wow. Now, I know that originally it was the Windsor Whip Company. They made whips here for carriages and buggies and <laughs> stuff. But then it turned into the Windsor Whip Art Gallery, correct? Correct, correct. Which is absolutely beautiful place. Look at this, look at those walls. I mean, you can do anything with that. And there are so many things you can do with this property. What a great investment for any business, I would say any business. Right, uh, advertising company out of New York. We're right on Route 17 and it's not that far to the city and we're just minutes away from Binghamton. So somebody could have a law offices, advertising company, you could use it for special events. I'll take it in the bank. A bank. a bank. I don't know. I don't know what banks <laughs> need. We could put the vault over there. But you could have an, a residence uh, upstairs, downstairs, whatever someone wanted to do. Beautiful uh, cherry floors, Brazilian cherry floors. Brazilian cherry floors. High ceilings. I love these columns. Just the ornate trim work that they built on these columns just gives everyone an idea of, you know, how detailed this is. Or even around the, the restroom doors there. There's nice tile floors. Yeah, don't forget, this is three floors. Each floor has a bathroom and a kitchenette. All right. And so has also, yes, and a very beautiful, Deck out the large, back. yes. Yeah. And it's very picturesque out there, so we'll, we'll go out we'll there. We'll go out there after, yes. And here is a great place for a boardroom. Yeah, uh, really it's more of the same, the same square footage, about 1,250 square feet per floor. Uh, the, the flooring, the lighting, it's really a beautiful place. All the windows, uh, high-end wood interior, insulated windows. I can tell you something, if I were a photographer, which I am, I would love to have a place like this because I can have a gallery downstairs and live upstairs because this is a great place. You can actually oh, yeah. have, you have kitchen, you have bathrooms, you have you, enough space to, you know, put living room and uh, bedroom yeah. and have a whole business downstairs and don't forget downstairs, downstairs. That's right. The basement, basement is, a, is a full basement, but the same way. And it's great that they use the stone foundation just like a, a New York City loft. It's just beautiful. Well, up here on the top deck really gives you a nice view of those cornfields and the river in the distance. There's a, a there's just a great feeling about this building and all the things that are surrounding it. It's like, old 1800s town and everything in this building although historically correct is all new the roof is a rubber roof the siding is a cement type of board that is uh doesn't need to be painted and every yeah and and, and everything's intact inside of course there is the beautiful floors, the tall ceilings, the restored trim work around all the windows and doorways. And don't forget, um, on all of these balconies, you can have events. They 
they have put tables before and they have very nice gallery openings. It is really good to yeah. have, yes. Yeah. It could be uh, really a perfect for any professional business. Now, this property, if someone wants to see it, what do they do? They can call me at 917-538-4695 or they can call John Burns at 607-725-2122.